Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to my channel. If you haven't already, hit that red subscribe button, the notification bell, and give me a thumbs up. Welcome to my Mo Better YouTube channel. Today I will be sharing some of the products that I have um, purchased from the new Happy Planner um, release. Um... I mean, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to share what I um, got from the release. Okay, so we're going to start with the sticker pads. Um, so far, they've had the Happy Girl, Happy Planner Girl line. Uh, the first one was... I can't even remember the names of all of them. My goodness, there's been so many. But anyway, I got a lot of the uh, products from that first line. The second line with the Healthy Hero and Socialite. I got the Socialite Healthy Hero. And I think that was it from that one. So this one, the only, I really didn't care for any of the planners, actually. Um... I love the homebody sticker books and stickers. Didn't care for the um, dashboard layout. And so when I get to the planner that I did choose, we'll get more into that. But we're going to start with the stickers. So I did grab the sticker pad for the homebody. It's 36 pieces. And um, they fit the dashboard planner layout. But you know that you can always make your stickers work for your spread, whichever layout it is. And so that's what I plan to do. I do have a uh, dashboard extent. I mean, dashboard extension, and also one of the wrong, wrong happy planner dashboard uh, planners in case I want to frank and plan. So it'll work out either way. But I did grab the sticker pad from the Homebody collection. The Encourager, I loved all the sticker books for it. The pad, I also purchased the, um, I think they're calling these the multi-accessory packs. And the classic size sticker book. I did not grab the mini because you can make the classic size stickers work for the mini. So... I just don't feel the need any. Before I would get the mini and the classic, but <coughs> excuse me, I just don't feel the need to get the mini as well. Into each zone, but that's what I got from the Encourager line as far as stickers. <coughs> and now this, I got the Stargazer. Um, let's see. Oh, I did grab that. Okay. Just a second. Okay, so I did grab the Stargazer sticker pad. I love, 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 love this purple foil. It is so pretty. And the teal foil. So I grabbed that one, and then I did grab the classic size uh, Stargazer sticker book. <clears throat> For the same reason, as I said, the Encourager, I don't feel the need to get the mini. I can make the classic size stickers work in either the mini or, of course, the classic. So that is what I got from the Stargazer line. And now I had contemplated on getting the Stargazer planner to be my wellness planner, but I did not decide to do that. Now, this is the home body. I got the classic and the mini. The reason behind that is when I went to um, Joann's, they were out of the uh, classic size, but they had like two mini. So I grabbed the mini because I love the florals in the sticker book. So then I ended up going across town and finding the classic size, so I just went on and grabbed the classic size. So that's why I have the classic and the mini and the homebody, as well as the um, sticker pad. And let's see, these are the last two sticker books from the Happy 
girl collection i grabbed the happy hostess the sticker book was the only thing that i really cared for i like, like the floral stickers i mean i like all the stickers in here they're really cute so i just grabbed the classic because we can make them work in either planner mini or classic and then the same with glam girl i wasn't really sold on the glam girl really to be honest with you uh but i like these diamond sh uh stickers here and these but i'm gonna use all my stickers though so that's why i just got the one um sticker book classic size and the glam girl and that is all that of the stickers that I actually really wanted from the new happy girl uh, from the new happy girl release now I did grab the encourage the encourager classic size planner because One, it's cute, and two, it has the Healthy Hero layout. So, I've been doing so well in my Happy uh, Happy Planner Healthy Hero planner that I decided this is probably going to be, most likely going to be my wellness planner for 2020. It goes from January to December, just like the Healthy Hero. Um, the only difference is this doesn't say, I think it says food log and the healthy hero. And even the sidebar is a little different, but we always, you know, we can switch up the sidebar or whatever. But yes, this is going to be my wellness planner. It was between this one and the stargazer. And I chose this one because I really do like the uh, healthy hero layout. So we're going to make that work as my um wellness planner for 2020 all right now the non happy girl sticker books from this new release i had to have the encouragement sticker book i think this is so uh such a good book to have with all the encouraging quotes um this will definitely do well in, in um, a wellness planner as well. Let me go back. Like word of the week, practice this week. Uh, I've seen something else. Maybe not. You have these stickers. Focus, love, mindset, vision, dream, speak, grow, rest. They, this book could even be good for your uh, guided journal as well depending on how you're using it. So I can see this sticker book here being up. When they start going on clearance, I'll be trying to grab two more of these. And then the horizontal layout. This is going to be perfect in my um, faith, faith planner because it's horizontal. I have to have a horizontal uh, faith planner because I write do the scripture reading and writing plans. I have to have room to write. And I write big. So I thought this would be. A, I was so glad when they came out with these uh, horizontal type stickers. I love these florals. So pretty. So I'll probably be getting two more of these books as well. When they go on a crazy sale or a crazy coupon. Or something like that. Now. I. Got the three. Mega books. From this. Newest release. I just could not. Not get them. So. I got. The rainbow book. It's awesome. I got the Brights sticker book. It's awesome. And I also got the Pastels sticker book. It's awesome. 
I, um, of course, did not pay full price for any of these books. Um, what was I going to say? I, when I was getting ready to do a plan with me, I flipped through the brights, flipped through the pastels, and I was like, I just don't want to use them yet. But I have used some of the uh, rainbow stickers in, a, in my uh, wellness planner. But yeah, got those three. So, out of the new release, I got, I did, I was able to acquire what I wanted. Um, I I know a lot of things came out and I just reevaluated what I really wanted versus what I kind of wanted, if that makes sense. I didn't go and spend hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of dollars like I've seen po I've seen posts on social media. I've seen one, I, it was as high as $700, but they were overseas, so I'm sure a nice amount of that was for shipping. But I just couldn't hand over like almost $800 worth of money for stickers and planners, even though that's what I love to do. I think that's going overboard, but to each his own. I've been doing this since 2016, 2017, and I can see my growth because when I first started, I think the first two or three months, I had spent almost $300 and I put myself on a no spend and I put myself on a budget because it's easy to get uh, wrapped up and out of control with it. And there's nothing wrong with doing what you like to do and, but I guess what I'm trying to say is doing what you like to do but you don't have to have all the things. And Mrs. Thinking of a Master Plan, she does a um, planning on a budget every week and she has good um, tips and tidbits on planning on a budget, you know, getting using those coupons and the additional 20 and 25% off and on top of the sales and, you know, because you don't want to go broke buying and doing things that you like to do it can easily turn into an addiction and you just have to you know control it don't let it control you so that is it i just wanted to share what i um acquired from the new release and i'm excited about using and showing you guys on my channel how i use it um and that is it so if you have any uh, questions or any comments, you're always welcome to leave them down below. And that is it. Until next time.